Hey guys, I'm Kyoko. Welcome back to Ember Imperator Rome, not something else. Yeah, it's Imperator Rome. Don't you worry about it. We've been uh, having a costly war down here. Very, very costly. The goddamn Gnosis knocked us out badly. I'm gonna ask for your military access so I can finally, after winning that stupid siege, get over here and uh, smack these bastards down. Yeah? I don't know where they went, the no, no sauces in. They're actually there. Are you in any other wars? They're actually in other wars. Alright, well that's great. I'm gonna just come and siege your stuff. Right now I'm gonna take all of your stuff. Just the way it is. So yeah, we lost a bunch of troops. Uh, we're gonna probably be losing some more troops soon. Because that's just the way the cookie crumbles. And we are of course losing a lot of money as well. It's uh, far from good. Very far from good. Uh, I did say, I did say I should move some slaves around to get some extra bonuses, extra research points uh, over here. Or this promise produces wood. Mm, okay, would be uh, bonuses from wood would be local tax, three percent. I don't know. But he already has slaves, so it's easier to bring slaves in here. Yeah. Could be something we do. Could be, because uh, it is uh, farmland, so we don't need that many slaves. So we could uh, bring slaves from other places around here. Megalopolis doesn't have any. This one, Mantinea doesn't have any. Troitzen doesn't have any. Interesting. So we would have to move them maybe from here. Maybe from Epidaurus. We can move them into... Uh, uh, oh, right. We, I don't think we can move them from here to here. I think I could move them from here to here. But I can't move them like from here to here because uh, they're not the same. Alright. Uh, because they're different provinces. That's why. And they would have to border, I believe, if we were to bring them in. Okay, uh, continue with this war. We're gonna see how things work. We're just gonna bring more slaves into our capital. Make some more money that way. Commerce bonus goes up. Awesome. We're actually now at zero over here, so it's not that bad. Still, we need more money. But uh, taking some lands over here is gonna give us a new province. A new province means uh, extra trade routes, and with extra trade routes, we get some extra money. So. Yeah, I think if you have a lot of provinces, it's a pretty not a bad idea to uh, to do some nice trading, get a lot of trade routes because every trade route is gonna get you extra stuff. Oh great, our leader uh, against Mentagra. Whatever that is, it's uh, wow, it lowers his charisma. Not fun. Oh, military tradition. We can take a new one. So, uh, yeah, we're gonna go down this way now. Light cavalry defense. Perfect. You see? It was a problem because we didn't have any uh, light cav, I think, when we were fighting these guys. Or maybe we did have some? I don't know. It just... The, the huge penalty over here was just obnoxious. It was just obnoxious. That minus two from uh, crossing over here. It's, it was really stupid. Especially because... You know, you would expect that after you already landed right and some months have passed it, this wouldn't be possible so <clears throat> we can give our veterans some farmlands uh, the general of third stratus will gain loyalty and uh, morale of army is gonna go down we're gonna lose a ton of money that we don't have or he loses loyalty and morale just just give them some farmlands sure the Olympic Games! Here I found one of our researchers. Uh, let's see. Uh, that's uh, one of our researchers. Efu Menes. That would be who? That's this guy. He's 10 at researching, so it's pretty good. And uh, this guy would be Makartatos, our here fund. He is at 11, so he's even better at that. So, sure, let's send the researcher. And now we need to assign a new researcher over here. Over here. 
Um, you're at seven. It's pretty terrible. Do we have any new scorned families? These guys are still scorned. Wish you guys would have anyone that's actually useful. Uh, this guy could be in a civic uh, trait. Let's actually check that. So that's one of these two. This guy has a uh, nine. Yeah. Oh, please. Don't, don't, don't give me like that. This guy has nine. So we could uh, assign this guy over here. And that should take them away from being scorned. Siege is one. Awesome. Thank you very much. Let's go uh, take this siege as well. I uh, don't care about those bastards over there. <clears throat> now they won their war. So they did. They did win their war. Gortinia is getting bigger, is it? Gortinia. Gortina. Gortina. Is what it is. Yeah. Where are you gonna go? You're probably gonna try sieging your own lands. Is my guess. And now I could fight you there because those hills are now occupied by me. Right? So we would get defensive bonus. Depends. Uh, I might break the siege if uh, I see that they are pro they are maybe progressing faster. Wow, our popularity isn't the greatest right now. They are definitely progressing much faster than we are on the siege stuff. Look at that. All right. Sure. Uh, combine you. I think we can. Uh, we can think we can find them. Yeah. <clears throat> Let's get them. Destroy them. It's, it's about time these guys pay for what they've done to us. Look at that. I don't know how far they've got already. They must have some nasty bonuses. Are we using shock action? Not exactly the best. But now they have the, the penalty. And we do have flanking ability now. Which is great. So our horses should kill these fools. We are victorious. Good. Where are they going? They're going over here. Let's murder them now fully. You bloody bastards. Get yourselves murdered, please. Thank you. There you go. Finally killed them all. About goddamn time. Now, we don't need all these troops uh, doing this stuff. Uh, I can't, in fact, detach a siege. Was you a siege or was he a siege? That's a good question. I think he is enough for a siege. This is supposed to be enough for a siege, but uh, it's not going to be enough for a siege. You guys are going to just go here so we don't take extra attrition. I'm just going to sit there on that province. Yeah. Uh, we lost a bunch of manpower and a lot of troops uh, going into this war, I'll have you know. But it gives us an extra land over here, which is, I think is important. If we ever want to, I don't know, expand. Crete might not be exactly the most amazing. Uh, what do we have in these lands, actually? Can I uh, check the province? There you go. So, they're producing wood. And this is hills. They're producing glass over here. Cool. And over here, they're producing iron. Nice. So, that's for heavy infantry. Yeah, we can do that. Solid. Uh, actually, you stay there. Let's bring these guys home. Maybe someone decides that uh, maybe they should come attack us at home. That wouldn't be <clears throat> the best idea. Grass expansion? Not really. Governor loyalty? Primarily cultural happiness could be solid. Uh, capital and port routes? Yes. Let's do it. Capital and port routes? Awesome. That means we have... Uh, one extra over here. Do we have one extra over here? No, just the capital. Okay. <laughs> so, about that papyrus. They would actually do it. Egypt would now actually do it. Okay, yeah, definitely doing that. So we can get finally those extra research points. Oh, we got uh, another kid. Wow. I guess your wife is quite a bangla, isn't she? That's pretty good. Okay, deliver these guys home. Thank you very much. Doesn't look like uh, this. Uh, this boats actually help with the siege status. Already, oh, you're gonna go over here. Sure, we do have a leader there, but we don't. 
Uh, no, I don't want uh, my slaves to become free, man. Actually, actually, we do have extra slaves over here that we don't really need that much. Sure, they're tax stuff. Freemen are manpower, and we're gonna need some manpower right now. So I'm gonna let you do it, I think. Actually, no, we need money. We need money, sorry, no no freedom for you. <laughs> we need money. Oh, look, the boats are going back in there. 21%, let's uh, get this one done, please. Anaxarchos Philarchid. Get it done, my friend. Get it done. Trade route? Uh, actually, we should be able to get that papyrus now. Let's go, finally. What's marble? Hmm. But yeah, we definitely want those extra stuff. Thank you! Now our research should be better. Uh, research is here. Let's see. Do we? Is it gonna count in right now? Or next month? We'll see. We shall see. We are producing like... 10, 11, not so long ago, so this is not too bad. The monthly tick has probably gone over already. So, where are we getting that bonus? Who knows? Oh, do we actually get... You know what? I think we actually get bonus in the capital. Is that it? Peace imminent. Okay, so... Uh, they want to enforce peace soon. Don't want that. Uh, let's see, this research? Yeah, okay, it counts over here. Okay, fair enough. Please win the siege so we can finish the stupid war. Or else uh, we're gonna be forced to peace out very soon. They're not happy with how long we've been in this war. To be honest, I'm not happy with how long we've been in this war. Finally! 100 freaking percent. Alright, sue for peace. Give me that and that. Yeah. All of this. And give me all of your money. Yeah. Gnosian Creed to Sparta. So we get all of these. I believe. Do it. Finally. No quarter. We need more popularity. More popularity. Thank you. Finally. We have uh, Gnosis over here. Eleutheria and uh, Polyrenia in Crete. Oh, it's about goddamn time we won that war. Aetolia? Uh, no, no, it's, it's okay. I need to look at you guys. Yeah, they do have huge defensive leagues now. Uh, that's fine. We got uh, extra stuff down here now to look at. So you are just uh, Rhodes. Rhodes is... Where's Rhodes? No, Rhodes? Where exactly are you? I know it's an island. Oh, it's here. Okay. No, that's free. Free, yeah. This is Rhodes. So, uh, they actually have your main island. And this is the rest of you, huh? That's okay. How about you, Prices? Hmm. But yeah, these guys, they have seven cohorts. I think these would be our next move. Um, can we assign our dude over here? I know this guy is better. But I do want to assign my dude back here. Yes, please. And we can bring the other cohorts down here when needed. Alright, okay. Uh, we were for a second there actually in the positive. We're no longer in the positive. I wonder why. I wonder why. So this culture down here should be... It's Cretan. Dominant culture is Cretan. This guy's probably not gonna be as happy, is my guess. Uh, he's, uh, he got arthritis. Wow, he's really not so happy about this. So we have the local autonomy going over here. Alright. Yeah, province loyalty, not the, the greatest. That's fine. That's okay. Uh, they do seem to be happy ish. So it's not too bad. Oh, there's a tribesman over here. Hellenic Cretan. Uh, can I uh, uh, promote you? Yeah, I'm gonna promote you. Yeah, we don't need tribes people. We want uh, freemen and all that stuff. Okay, now we need to try recovering our manpower a bit because it's not so good, is it? Uh, you should have a trade route. Indeed. Let's actually get a trade route out here. 
Uh, which is uh, which place is the capital of? Uh, this is Knossos is the capital of, uh, right? Capital of Crete. Yeah, that's good. Mm, let's get a trade route over here. We could even get some uh, papyrus over in this uh, region. Yeah, there's a bunch of citizens. Not producing that much research yet, but I don't think that would be bad. Let's get me some more papyrus from Memphis. Sure. It's not that big of an effect, but uh, if you can do more research, that wouldn't be hurting us, right? Wow, we're losing a lot of money. Holy shit. <laughs> uh, fleet maintenance, decrease the pay. Uh, fort maintenance is already decreased pay, but we have a bunch of forts. I'm gonna destroy some of these forts. Definitely don't need three forts down here. We're gonna leave one in Gnosis. This fort, get rid of it. This fort, get rid of it. Yeah. It does have a marketplace as well, which is cool. So that's two forts gone. Pretty freaking sure we don't need all these forts either. Uh, I'm gonna get rid of your fort. Six freaking forts? No. This one we're gonna keep. This one we're gonna keep. I'm gonna get rid of your fort. I know it's right on the border there, but hey. Tale of two cities. Oh, we are almost not losing money now. Eleutheria and Gnosis. So, there's these two. Uh, Eleutheria, I should say. So, one gets more tags than the other. Now, none of these guys have much tags. He just grown a tribesman? No, they had a tribesman over here already. Uh, you have a bit more tax income, so sure. Gnosis? Yeah, you can have a bit more. It's not a problem. Uh, I will promote you. Because we have a bunch of oratory power. In fact, I think we should go over here. Maybe promote some more of these freemen. Sure, that's manpower, but... It would be kind of great. Actually, if we could get some more people in here, we could uh, get another building. I think every 10 people is an extra building. Not that we really need them right now. Not really. Uh, but... I think I might do promotion. We do more research, you know? Uh, this is oratory power. Yes, please assimilate the Hebrews. They should be happy about that. And, uh... Yeah, let's, uh... Promote... Some more of these guys. Yeah, we get some more citizens. That really didn't cost us uh, much, did it? Go back. Yeah, there you go. There's four tunes now. Extra research. It's always good, isn't it? I hope so. Alright, uh, we're not going to go to war for a bit now. We need to <laughs> recharge on this whole thing for a bit. Uh, because, oh man, we that was a... Uh, that was obnoxious war, is all I'm gonna say. Naval landings are always tough. Always tough in any game you play. Uh, we have less people than we might have wanted, but that's okay. Minister of Excellence. National tax. Or he gains loyalty, he gains money. Definitely he's excellent. Uh, definitely he's excellent. Good. Alright. I'm happy with that. I'm also happy that Macedonia is not as powerful before. <laughs> Rome is growing. Uh, actually, score. How are we third in the world on score? I think it's probably our tech, if I had to guess. Look, we're actually making money right now. Give me... Uh, show me this quickly. Yeah, you see, we are making more money from commerce now than we did before, so I think it's worth going into commerce for a bit. Blessing of Hermes, and we'll see what that does for us. It's, uh, I think it's pretty well now. Yeah, I think we're doing okay in that, that way. More provinces, more trade routes, all that stuff is good, always. Yeah. So we are actually making uh, some positive income now, which is great. I let's let's check this actually. So we are four in all of the techs. Macedon is one. These guys are a bit better. Rome is a two. So you see, we are doing pretty well on research. Phrygia, 
This huge nation over here is at zero. Seleucids have one in oratory. Moria is at one. So yeah, uh, focusing a bit more on research, it's well worth it, I'd say. It is well worth it. And we have extra oratory power now. Uh, in fact, uh, there is somewhere you can check this. Yeah, so right now we have neutral stance. This is something I want to change. This is something I forgot to change. So you, you always start with something, right? And neutral stance is just we have extra diplomatic relations, which we are not using at all right now. So doesn't really doesn't really matter as much, right? Uh, we can do appeasing stance, aggressive expansion, decay, improve relation cost. The pit of our allies goes up, and uh, others goes up. We can go mercantile, which is going to be extra commerce income. Uh, it's going to get uh, trade routes. Create trade route costs is going to be less. And uh, opinion others with mercantile is going to go up. And uh, others in diplomatic range is going to go up. We can go bellicose, which is going to war score cost and fabricate, fabricate claim cost. Uh, if you want to go to war, which would make sense for a Spartan. But right now, we need to recover. So... I don't think we need to do that really. Integration speed, loyalty of subject states. So I think we're gonna go mercantile. That's plus 25% on uh, what we already have over here. It just goes plus, it doesn't go extra 25. So we're gonna be making even more money right now. So balance, for the first time in, well, since the start pretty much, we're actually nicely positive. And if you're nicely positive, that just means we can build some more buildings. That wouldn't hurt us, right? So, Megalopolis probably wouldn't. Uh, oh, has happened. Euphemia, daughter of the Basileus, becomes friend with someone. Sure. Um, so, if we did a uh, marketplace, tax income, commerce income, civilization level. We do have uh, two trade routes over here, so that could be nice from commerce stuff. We do have some unrest around. It's not exactly amazing, but hey, garrison, supply limit. Uh, we could we could build a marketplace over here. We could build buildings over here as well. Hmm. This one does more on research. So uh, where does the where does it show the commerce income? Is just is that just for the province? Is that provincial commerce income or in this area, uh, which is they produce earthenware? I, to be honest, I'm not quite sure. I'm not quite sure how that works. Apparently, over here we already have the building. Uh, that's Atolia wants to be friends. Dardania, you can have uh, that. Invention. What do we want to take? National tax, free man output, commerce income. We could still go for more of that. Supply limit, army maintenance. Army maintenance could be a really good thing to take. Uh, actually, primary culture happens. That's small amount, but it probably would be good. I'm gonna actually take this because in the long run, this is gonna benefit us uh, by a lot. Because probably uh, our army stuff is the most money. Yeah, that we're losing. Fort maintenance is pretty big as well, but otherwise, army maintenance is quite huge. And uh, I still wanna make more troops. Just uh, gonna wait a bit. So you guys uh, have roads out there, which. I don't think he's gonna be able to help you if we actually go to war. Rhodes, how many triremes do you have? Zero. So there's no way these guys can actually come help you. Uh, let's see, how many forts do you have? You have uh, level one and level one over here. So if we smack you, we can take all of this stuff. So as I was, as I was saying, let's uh, recharge a bit, not go to war. Well, how about we go to war? <laughs> how about we go to war? Because that's quite a lot of uh, clay over here that we can take. And these guys are fighting pirates out there. How unfortunate. I mean, we still have 8k manpower. Surely we can do that. Manpower recovery speed, I have found, is pretty low. So these guys all loyal to you? Yeah, these guys are all loyal to you. Uh, that's... Could be a bit of a problem. Could also not be a bit of a problem. This is... Uh Every stuff here is heals. There's some forest, but otherwise just heals. Amazing. Two forest provinces, everything, everything else is heals. Alright, well. That's okay. Let's have you combined. So you have two archers. Probably don't even need 
the archer. So we have the shock assigned right now. Uh, Phalans give us the most, pretty much. So I'm surprised that light cavalry does so well over here. Hmm. So military, do we have? Uh, that's gonna be quite costly. Next one. So let's see. Four defense right now is not good. We have extra siege ability, and then we have heavy infantry, extra morale. And our hippies have extra defense. Alright. Renovations. So we are renovating something. Uh, Agiad family gains prestige. We have a lot of prestige. Uh, I guess we have a lot of prestige. To be honest, I don't know how that actually works. And we get popularity, which we definitely need. And someone else gets uh, prestige, we lose some money. Uh, sure, release the founts. Let's get some extra popularity. This is fine. Release the founts! Or funds, I should say. These guys are really huge. <laughs> uh, omen power goes up. Morale of stuff goes up. Awesome. Uh, yeah, I think we kind of are going to go to war with you. I don't think Rhodes is actually going to help you. In, you know, excuse me. Uh, military access. Uh, I need to cancel my military access first. Sorry, I forgot about that. It's gonna take a while. They might try finding friends, but that ain't gonna work well for them. And I'm fine uh, conquering Crete before we return back up here. And just hopefully wait for these uh, alliance chains to dissolve a bit. Maybe people go gonna go to war with each other again. I would love to get uh, City of Olympia because it has, you know, Olympia there. Yeah, so that would be cool. All right, you guys, um, please. I will fabricate a claim. We have 400 oratory power. It's gonna give us a claim. It's not too bad. Wherever I attack you right now, I'm gonna have minus one penalty, but should be fine. These guys have light infantry, while we have the horses. Actually, uh, let's check. You are good versus light infantry. Indeed, you are. Uh, let's see, archers are good versus light infantry as well, and these guys are also good versus light infantry. Not go good versus light cavalry, not good versus light cavalry, and these guys should be uh, neutral against light cavalry. But I only have two cav, while well, we have the rest. Okay, 1st of February, we can start our new war, which is gonna be now. Roads, go, confirm. It is time to go to war. Low Navy maintenance? We're not even gonna use Navy. Go here, lead us to glory! He's going there. He's gonna get there on 12th of February. We're gonna be doing there on 23rd. That's a fort. We'd like to go fight you on a fort. Oh, your morale is low. Let's see where you're going from here. You're just standing there. Can I... Really? Um... I can't get there. I can get there. Let's jump back here. Uh, would be nice. Would be real nice. I want to see them lock in here. Should have checked when they arrive. Should have checked. I'm gonna just stand here for a second. I'm gonna jump on your fort. Ugh, so they're gonna wait in those hills. Well, we can't fight them. We can't. They're gonna wait there. Uh, they're gonna increase their army size. This is this is actually not good for us. I was hoping I could jump them. I can't. Ugh. Uh, we can have a person join our court. Or we get morale of armies and four defense. I'll definitely take that. But they're gonna boost up their uh, cohorts. But they're just boosting up with light infantry. Which I think could be beneficial for us. Okay, uh, sure, this guy can go to Olympic Games. Let's have you go. Please go here. Yes, I would love you if you went to siege that place. Please lock in. I will abandon this siege. No worries. Thank you very much. This, this is good. It's unclear. We have 9k. We have 14k. Their morale is not high. And we have defensive bonus over here from hills. How is this unclear? Our site might lose? Okay, I, I... You know what? I need to see this. How will our site maybe lose? 
We get bonuses, they get malices. And uh, that's about it. I don't think you uh, exactly know what you're talking about, game. You're definitely very victorious. Weren't we? Okay, well, I guess we have to uh, actually take your capital. Virtina. Before we can move anywhere else. But we smacked you, which is good. This uh, is a level 1 fortification, isn't it? Yeah. So that's not too bad yet. It's only one scorn family. It's fine. That's acceptable. We're gonna be, again, taking a lot of attrition. Due to siege in this. Hopefully recovery speed is gonna go up a bit. Ah... Uh, Let's win, boys. Let's win this war. Well, better luck next time. Our popularity goes up. At least this time around, we won a freaking fight early on. Okay, we are regrowing. Good. We need more siege ability, to be honest. So, uh, yeah, any anything in that direction would be nice, to be honest. Actually, I wanted to check. Do we have anyone that's still Jewish around here? Because we have a lot of... Uh, points that we could spend to make you a bit happier. Probably easier way to check that. So our demo fane was uh, that? Is that what the title was? No, it was with this title. Archie something something. Uh, sure, this was uh, the previous general. He's quite loyal. Put him there. He used to be a general, now he's gonna be... What is that thing gonna be? He is... Uh, you know, our royal bodyguard. Or in charge of our royal body boys. That's great. These guys are hiding somewhere out there. Uh, probably against these fortifications. When we uh, get this thing. Which we just did. Great. I'm gonna gain some popularity. I don't want to kill more people. Uh, we got one slave to Sparta. They're bringing 10k people back here. That's good. These are now gonna get occupied automatically. Uh, at least these two. This one is probably shared with this one. So not... So he's bringing 10k troops over here. We're gonna fight them. Once he locks. We're gonna win this fight. I'm pretty freaking sure. He's locked. Oh. I'm about to bring them here. Saying our side might lose. I don't believe you. I think our side will win. Because... Let's unpause. So they did use bottleneck. But they do have one... Wait. Did I destroy the fortification here? I did destroy the fortification over here. Did I? I thought I left the fort here. Oh, uh, that's my mistake. I think we still should win. We still should easily win, even though we have minus one. Yeah. Definitely winning. National Commerce Income, Monthly Wage for Characters. Alright. And we can do one of these. Now, what do we do? Siege Engineers. I think that's better seed stuff. So, I think we're definitely going to take that. Research Points. This is pretty good. This is actually pretty good. Assassinate Cost. Tribute Income. Home Empower. Religious Tech Investment. National Manpower. Uh, I will take the Siege Engineers since we are at war right now. That should be good. Yeah. As I said, we're going to smack these. And uh, this thing's got occupied now. It's actually kind of hard to see the way things are. And uh, we're gonna chase you. Hopefully you're gonna go into this fort. That would be my, my hope. And that's where you're gonna go. If you go there, I don't think we can reach you. No, I think that's where you're going. Let's see. Tara. No, they're going here. Yeah, definitely going after you. I'm sorry. Did that really destroy a uh, Gnosian thing? I guess it did. Huh. No, you're definitely getting murdered over here. I'm sorry. There you go. Stack wipe the bastards. This is how we do it, boys. This is how we do it. Crete is going to be ours. But for now, thank you everybody for, for watching. I do hope you enjoyed it. Click that notification bell if you want to see more. And I'll see you next time. Kick her out.